Welcome back to another episode of Dragon Age Origins. Let's get to it. Let's not waste any time. Be careful now. All right. Uh, you know, I um, forgot which way we were going. Well, I guess we're going this way. Okay. That's what happens when you take a couple days off. Oh, we weren't done. We weren't done. Let's see. Oh, they're right there. Um. Oh. Oh, we can't. We can't go this way. I guess we're looting. All right. All right, so we actually um, got the acorn for the elder tree or whatever his name was. And um, he it gave us a way to get past that like foggy area, which is where we should be heading now. I, I took a couple days off this weekend because of, um, I guess you would call it a holiday, Memorial Day, which is today for me. Is is this the way? This is the way. And this is the way. And um, so I need to <laughs> remember what I'm doing. All right, let's see if this works. Looks like it is. Grand Oaks branch allows you to pass the barrier. Yeah, let's save here. This is the, the game save, so we're saving. You know the drill. Swift Runner, nice to meet you again. The forest has not been vigilant enough. Still, you come. You need to put something on here, sir. You are stronger than we could have anticipated. The Dalish chose well, but you do not belong here, outsider. Leave this place. I don't want to fight you. I don't want to fight you. <sighs> Why won't you let me settle, try to settle this dispute? <sighs> you are sent by the treacherous Dalish to kill with a fang. I will not stand by and allow that to happen. Oh, we're about to fight, aren't we? Why do you call the Dalish treacherous? You attack them. And they deserve no less. You are an intruder in our home. You come to kill, as all your kind do. We have learned this lesson well. Here, Witherfang protects us. Here we learn our names and our beloved. We will defend Witherfang and this place with our lives. Oh, no. We fight. Oh. We almost had Swift Runner. Okay. Um. Let's see here. Onyx demon statuette that has to be Alistair. Gravestone. I shall do it. Familiar warding's runes are carved into this tombstone. Disturb the wards. Of course we are. Oh. Very well. Oh, jeez. Gotcha. <laughs> I 
And down. Chainmail boots we can do without. What do you have? Juggernaut plates, heavy plate armor. Nothing special. Quest updated. Wah, 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 wah. You have recovered two of the items hidden in the forest by the Deventer Mage. Two more remain. I shall do it. Okay. There was another site like this out in the beginning area that, for some reason, we already opened this. Um, this isn't... Uh, it didn't work, so I'll have to check that out. Now, what the heck? Oh, is this way. It has to be. Okay, I'm gonna fight some more. We are invaded! Intruders have deceived their way into the Intruder forest alert. Fall back to the ruins! Intruder Protect alert! The lady! Okay. Oh, I thought we were fighting. The Guess werewolves not. live in an old ruin? Hmm. I wonder if there are other treasures to be found here besides wolf droppings. I don't know, Zevran, maybe. But um we're not here for that. But if, you know, there is treasure, that's just a bonus. Okay. Alright, here we go. Looks very reminiscent of Andraste's temple. Is that? Okay. Alright. It seems that elves once lived with the Tevinter humans. Or the Tevinter built this place for them. Oh. I never heard of such a thing. Okay. Very well. So then that speaks for the the architecture of this place. Don't give them the advantage. <laughs> <laughs> bloodletting, I see. <laughs> Take all. Is there any like secret passageways? I feel like these are. Oh shoot! It shall be done. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I swear I didn't even know that. Okay. Um. So is this is this one too? Oh wait. What can I go back up the stairs? Is it is it too late now? I can't go back up. I shall do it. Oh! Very well. Okay. Are they both open? The things I discover when I play this game. Love letter. I bet you. Let's take this. Take all. Codex updated. Is this all the way down here? Uh, we already read this one. Read this one too. My elf root. The herbalist suggested powdered bronto horn. I was very discreet. You're a sunflower. All right, how many of these do I need? Quests, complete quests. Um, I, Mages Collective, Places of Power. Uh, I have no idea what dinner. Trials of the Crows, Forgotten Verses. No. Blackstone Irregulars, deliver four letters of condolences. No, that's not it. Lorana near the Lake Kalanhad, Irania in Redcliffe, and Sarah and Tanya in Dinnerum. I have no idea what this would be. All right. I, ugh. Okay. Anyways. Is there any treasure over here? Nope, but I'll take your money. And I'll see what's over here. Wait, I already looted this guy. Yeah, we've decided that we weren't going to take that. All right, let's see what's in this. What the... That's weird. Okay. Wait, first, before we forget. This looks like filth. Florin filth. Okay. Okay, obviously we can go down there. We need these. 
pretty sure we do. Alright, so gonna head up this way. This must oh. oh, this is a dead end. I shall do it. Dalish gloves, one dex. We'll take it. I don't know. Dark spawn mace. Eh, leave it. I don't know why I took the Dalish gloves over the mace, but I feel like Zevran might use them. Let me see. He probably doesn't need them, to be fair. No, he does. He absolutely does. Yeah, these are way better. Well, not way better, but definitely better. Okay. So, do we go down here? That is a locked door. Lair of the werewolves. So, we need, we need to take the long way around? Ugh, it's gonna be spiders. Of course it is. Of course there's spiders. These are all spider eggs. There's nothing down here. There's no point in me going down here. Why do I keep get, getting stuck on the... There's a spider web right there. What's down here? So I'm gonna go down here and something's gonna jump out at me. Begun. We'll take that green stone. I keep getting stuck on the stairs. That is not good. All right, Alice. Oh, okay, it's gonna say, Alistair, you try. <laughs> Alistair, you try going. To you come towards me. I'm not going on that way. Told you. have to be Very well. spiders. Oh, come on. <laughs> oh, that is nasty. Nasty. Alright, we'll just um, pretend that didn't happen. I don't ever want to... Yeah, this is probably full of... Oh, this is gross. Alistair, you're the tank. <gasps> Sacrifice. <laughs> Not. Watch, there's nothing in here. All right. Iron ring. We don't really need it. Off I go. We don't need that either. Just leaving stuff behind. Except for that. We'll take that. Uh, we'll, we'll use you to pick this. Land shield. Eh. Alright. E siguiente. It's another spider room. You know what, Alistair? You know they're coming down the middle, right? Done. You know they're coming down the middle. Look at that. Look at that. Whatever. If they're gonna if they're gonna come and get us, they're gonna come and get us. Iron ring. You wonder who's in those. Alright, I guess we're going down. What the heck was that? I literally jumped. Yeah, let me save. What the heck was that? I jumped. Oh my I think gosh. Ahead. You think? Big. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Somebody hungry? Look there. Trap. Honey, I am not worried about that trap. trap. I'm worried about what is in this room. Look there. A cunning trap. Okay. We'll just get all these traps. Very well. It's a trap. Yes, yes, yes. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's a, it's a, it's a dragon. 
It's a, it's a. Very well. It's a little one. Shall be done. Ooh. It's a little baby. Down you go. Oh, okay. Oh. Codex updated. A dragon. So there's dragonlings, drakes, and dragons. I would say this was a, a, a well, it's not a dragonling. Oh. Night corpse. You poor sots. You poor, poor sots. So you made it past the spiders, but the, the dragon got you. Hmm. Bad luck, that is. Alright. And there's treasure. What is it with dragons and treasure? Anything in here? Couple things. Let's see. Oh! Couple things. Oh my gosh. Okay. This is gonna fit like, yeah. We're gonna take all this. Definitely taking this. Silver medallion. Oh, we'll take that. Soldier's helm. Yeah, we'll take that. And this. And this and this. And this new codex. Falden, Friend of the Dead cast. That is a long... I'm not reading that. Oh, Falden, Levenavir, guide my feet, call my soul. Call my soul, lead me to my rest. That, uh, we'll keep that. We'll, we'll, we'll keep that for me real later. Yes. Gaja my party. Gaja my party and... What? Okay. Here we go. I shall do it. I'll do it. Need mushroom. Oh! Did you see that move? Take all. As you say. Let's head over here. I shall do it. And ouch. Hmm. Very well. Anything good? No. I shall do it. And uh, no. Alright. We'll leave that. B. Raise your hand if you would be down here. I mean, the spider webs alone for me, like this stuff, you know there's a giant spider coming out of this wall. That's enough for me to say no. Oh gosh, they psyched me out. Oops. Hello. You almost didn't make it, Severin. The only good bug is a dead bug. A shambling skeleton. What was that? Did anybody else hear that? Because I heard it. Oh, jeez. Alright, who wants to be the bait here? Oh, oh I made it. Alright, well... Look at this. All these, um, weapons. Alright. 
Oh, this is a beautiful room. Look at this. This is gorgeous. Oh. <laughs> Mommy? Mommy, no matter, son. Calm down. Tell me who you are, child. Calm down, what are you seeing? These things have unusual okay. powers. Be wary. Very well. That is That's my spider. I thought I was summoning the wolf and I summoned the spider. So that is my that's my pet spider. Why Very I would have well. a pet spider, I don't know. Alright, um I don't know if these are dead ends or not. But we'll find out. We'll go in here first. Oh no, these are It is begun. Not dead these are dead ends. Tablet. This earthen tablet is covered in pictographs, a fancy scroll. A scroll of parchment decorated with fancy gold handles. I bet you that's something that... Uh, oh, a carved elven tablet, new codex. Four panels reproduced here appear to be a part of a much larger mural. The topmost panel shows a jug overflowing with water standing on an altar. Three elves in robes are positioned around the altar while a crowd of elves in warlike regalia stands just slightly apart from them. Just below it is a depiction of all of the elves, those in robes and those in armor, prostrating themselves before the altar with worshipful expressions. The third from the top is a carving which shows one of the three robed figures, a woman with an elaborate tattoo on her face, drinking from the jug on the altar with, while the other elves watch. The bottom image shows the tattooed woman standing waist deep in a pool of water. She holds a jug with water spilling out of its mouth. The armored elves bow before her, describing a strange tablet. Okay. New quest. Complete the ancient ritual. The earthen tablet you recovered is covered in writing, perhaps elven. Most of the lettering is faded, making it indecipherable. There are numerous pictographs, however, which seem to indicate some kind of cleansing ritual to perform prior to honoring the dead. The first pictograph depicts a filled earthen jug being placed on an altar. The second shows an elf kneeling before the altar and praying. The third shows an elf taking a single sip from the jug. The fourth shows the elf emptying the remainder of the water in the, of the water in the jug into a pool. The last shows an elaborate doorway perhaps opening or closing. It is unclear which. Okay. So, uh, okay, okay, uh, looks like we, we've got, um, a puzzle to solve. All right, so we need one here. Very well. How are you guys getting through here? I feel like this is it like begun. meal time for the werewolves too. Are the werewolves and the spiders getting along well? Are they living together? It seems like peacefully, yeah? If they're living in here. With the sp With the spiders. Oh gosh. I was waiting for one to jump out on me. Alright, do we go this way? Or do we go this way? Let's go this way first. Alright. Yeah, let's just go this way. Alright. Fountain. All right, this looks uh, this looks like we need to be this way. Okay, that spider freaks me out. You need to go somewhere, really. Um, so, okay, so we need a jug of water. We need a jug. Is there a jug? 
Hold on. Okay, let's see. Um, the first pictograph depicts a filled earthen jug being placed on an altar. A filled earthen jug. So where do we get a jug? Do we just... We click on the... Oh! The water in the pool appears cool and clean. It is refreshed from some internal source. Perhaps magically submerged in the water is what appears to be a small earthen jug. Um... Examine and test the water carefully. Take the earthen jug. Take the jug out of the pool. It is made of clay and appears to be none the worse for its long submersion. Um, fill the earthen jug with water. Okay. Leave the pool alone. Alright, so then... It says that the second... Shows an elf kneeling before the altar and praying. Kneeling, wait, filling, placing, placing the jug on the altar. So we're going to need to do that. Put the jug on the altar. Um, place a fill, I think jug on top. Okay, yeah. And then we're going to kneel. Wait, kneel before the altar and pray. Now I would not be doing this. Kneel before Zod. Okay. Uh, now leave the altar. Wait, kneel before they leave an offering on the altar, examine the carvings, so closely examine the earthen jug on the altar, leave the altar. Now what? So, the third chosen elf taking a single sip of water from the jug. Um, examine the earth. Oh, shoot. I guess examine the earthen jug. The earthen jug sits on the altar and is currently filled with water. Take a single sip from the water in the jug. You carefully take a sip from the water in the jug and then replace it on the altar. Do I now take the jug? I think I take the jug, right? Leave the altar. And then I think it, you pour... Hold on. Uh, single sip. Pour shows the elf emptying the remainder of the water in the jug into a pool. So we're going to pour the back As in here. Say. The water in the pool appears. Okay, we saw that. Dump the water in the jug back in the pool. Slowly you spill the water out of the jug back into the pool. And as soon as the jug is empty, it suddenly shatters. The pieces fall into the pool. And open sesame. Hello. Uh huh. Tread carefully, boys and girls. Tread carefully. Uh huh. Yeah. I don't like this one bit. I do not. I don't trust this. Well, of course, you guys have been here. I think we work well together. You got blood on me. I hate that. Hmm. Sorry about that. All right. Uh, Elven burial chamber, pile of bones. Is there anything over here that we need to know? All right, let's go deal with this up here. And she's speaking Elvish. Nay, Gran Sudale, Gran. Uh, she looks human. You need help? Are you lost here, spirit? Yeah. Um. Oh no, come on. Okay, that hurt. That hurt. I am ready. 
Did we kill her already? That was fast. What's this? All right, so we need to elven burial train, juggernaut plate armor. Nice. New codex. Ol Olfanera. That is a long. Oh, let's read it. To the ancient elves who existed during the time of our. Arlathon, youth, youth and Nera was an act of re reverence. Elves did not age. They were not immortal, but they did not suffer from the deterioration of mind or body. They suffered only from a deterioration of the spirit. It did not help, happen often, but the oldest of the elves were said to reach a point where they became wary of life. Memories became too much to bear, and rather than fade into complacency, they voluntarily stood aside to let the newer generations guide their people. Uthanera means the long sleep, in which the elder would retire to a chamber that was one part bed and one part tomb. It's a great ceremony from all the extended family. The elder would succumb to a slumber from which they would not wake for centuries, and often never. In time, the body would deteriorate and the elder would die in truth. All the while, the family would continue to visit the chamber to pay respect to the one who made such a great sacrifice. With the arrival of humans and the quickening of the elven blood that ensued, the practice of euthanera began to fade. When Arlathan fell, it ceased forever. From what has passed by Hassandriel, Lord of Hala, Halamsharel, 2-7 Glory. That's interesting. I didn't know that. All right. Pile of bones. Scout's bow. And eh, we'll take it. Um, I Oh, quest updated. Did we not? Mage's treasure. You have recovered the okay three items hidden in the forest by the Deventer Mage. One item remains to find. Yeah, but where am I supposed to find that? It better be in the temple. No, I think it's at one place at the beginning. Hopefully we'll pass by it. Alright. Let's get out of here. You know what? Let's save real quick because I don't want to lose. I don't want to lose our spot? No. Anyways. Alright, so. Wait. Oh, crap. Which way did we go? I don't know. Oh. Hmm? The altar there. Not for nothing, but the spider is, you know, pretty tanky. Uh, it is hanging on fairly well. I think I'll keep it. Out. Not, you know, as a pet or anything. Well, that's my pet. But, um. Alright, let's go check this altar. And, uh, there's this broken crate. We'll take the blank vellum. Phylacter. Phylactery? It shall be done. This elaborate artifact has a gem-like structure that contains what appears to be blood, fresh and liquid, even after all this time. The gem is vibrating slightly. Show the artifact to the other party members. This appears to be a phylactery of some kind. The essence of a mage kept magically preserved. If that were all it is, however, I would be surprised. It looks elven, all right. Considering that what I know of my ancestors, you could fit into a gem half that size, uh, that's all I could really tell you. Is that blood in there? Whose, I wonder? Hmm. You'd think it would be all dried up after so long. There must be magic involved. Touch the gem? The gem is warm to the touch and your mind immediately begins swimming with visions, images, and memories from a life not your own. Who are you? What are you? 
The presence thinks quickly, bewildered. Finally, it decides that you are indeed real and not a product of its fevered imagination. More images flash through your mind. Time that the presence uh, has trapped within the life gem. Time where the presence has slept, gone mad, and then slept again. Hmm. The presence has no name it can remember. You get the sense of an elf, mage in glittering silver armor. But this was long ago. Remembered as if though through a fog. What is this place? What happened here? The image that comes are slow. The images that comes are slow, as the presence must think back to a time it barely recalls at all. You see a place of serenity where the eldest come to slumber and are visited by those who offer tribute to the gods on their behalf. Was this a war with the humans? How did you end up in this gym? You were once a mage. Was, uh, yeah, how did you end up in this gym? You see images of a great battle, elves and humans both screaming and attempting to flee from some terrible presence. What the presence was, it's blurry and lost in time. How do I know that you're not a spirit trying to tricking me? You see a faint image of a mage holding the life gem and ch chanting in an unknown language. There are no memories. The presence does not know how to prove this to you. There are no other memories. Is there anything I can do for you? You were once a mage. You see images again of the elf in silver armor, one who is mage and warrior both. The name for the order he belongs to translates in your mind to arcane warrior. So this is how I learn arcane warrior, but I've already done that. What is an arcane warrior exactly? The presence can remember a little. You see images of an order of elven mages who channel their spells and their strength. Fighting as an arcane, fighting as arcane warriors to defend their charges. Okay, the presence could give you what knowledge remains within it of how it becomes an arcane warrior. You see, you are no mage yourself, but you could teach such knowledge to those who are. This is all the presence has left to offer any longer. The last of its memories. In return, the presence asks only one thing from you: oblivion. How would I give you the release you seek? The images that come are faint and uncertain. You see a stone altar and the life gem placed upon that altar. Continue. The life gem then vibrates and explodes, destroying the presence within forever. The yearning that follows this image is keen and almost hopeless. All right. <sighs> yes, I will try to... Oh, you could teach me to become an arcane warrior? Well, maybe. The, image, the images that the present sends are desperate. It will give you what it's what memories it has. Whoever follows the arcane warrior's path will be the last of its order. Okay, yes, I will try to help you. The images become tinged in desperation. The presence cannot remember where the altar is, but it knows the life gem must be placed on it. Approach the stone altar with a gem. So this is the altar, okay. The images that are sent to your mind depict a clear question. Do you still wish to learn the skills of the arcane warrior? The presence is ready to teach you now. Yes, give me your memories. The memories flood in your mind. They are hazy and incomplete, but enough for any mage to gather a few of the talents that the arcane warriors once possessed. Now the presence asks you that you keep your promise, release it from its eternal prison. I wonder what would happen if I didn't. Not that I would. Nah. Nah. <laughs> Sorry, you might be useful later. Place the artifact in the stone altar. Nah. Toss the artifact aside. No. I'm going to do what's right. The last images from the presence are ones of joy. Oblivion will be a welcomed relief. It seems like, yeah, new quest, the Arcane Warrior. Placing the life gem on the altar destroyed it, granting the presence the release it had craved for centuries. Specialization unlocked. So we unlock the Arcane Warrior, and I don't know if I want to give that to Wen or not. Um, I feel like Wen could benefit from it. But, mm. oh wait, 
Uh, let's give you some more magic. Oh, 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 it's magic. Give you some more cunning. Uh, all right. We're gonna skip that. Alrighty. What do we got? The pile of bones up here. Pi Oops. Pile of I keep forgetting I can't jump. You'd think I'd know by Very now. Well. Scale armor. We will leave it. We will leave it. Alright, now I have to figure out where the heck I was. So we went... Wait. Were we in here? How dare you? Okay. Yeah, we were here. So we need to go... The spider's still hanging on, guys. So we need to go down this way, I think. I feel like. Or did we... Oh my gosh. We were in here. Okay, so... How did I get turned around? This is ridiculous. Okay, we were in here already. Maybe it's this way. Is it? No. Okay. Let's think for a moment. Is there a map? There is a map. Alright, so... If we... We go this way, maybe? Nope, this way. It is this way. Right? Okay. What? Is there an upstairs? Uh. What? Okay. I am so confused right now. Let's go back out this way. Okay. We came through here. Oops. Oh. Do we go here? Okay, that looks like that's where we need to go. Do we loot this? Yeah, I think we were in here. Yeah, we did. Okay. So we need to go this way. This is the right way. And back into the cave system. I bet you there's a bunch of spiders down here, too. Why I'm so worried I'm worried about spiders. This is not it. What? Entrance level. Oh! Wait a minute. Um. Yeah, we. Okay. Yeah, we. Very well. Yeah, we we already came this way. All right. Pix is lost. Wouldn't you know it? Okay. All right. So. Where am I going? So we can't go that way. And this is a dead end. Yes? And this is a dead end. Right? Yes, those are dead ends. So it has to be this way. There is no other way. Okay, so once we came in here, we went one of two ways. This is the way. Because we decided to go this way. That is right. Okay. Okay. Yes. Now. Oh, okay. Mm. First and foremost, there are way too many. Okay, we, we did this already. We did this already. Hmm. 
bet you guys are screaming at me. Okay, there we go. Oh, there's a door right here. Let's take care of business. door closed so I don't get turned around again because that is I don't need that all right let's go down here and see what's here I have a feeling this is probably a dead end it is glass phylactery another one be done. there is no obvious order to this jumble of miscellaneous but one item stands out a small glass phylactery Another one. The area is unnaturally cold. Dark shapes and s dark shapes swirl around a slip of paper within the vial. Take the vial. The glass fractures at your touch. Something's gonna jump out. Oh! It's another one of you. Down you go! Just die already! I don't get blood all over me, okay? I love this game. I do it quickly. Now we play a little. As you say, yes. Plain armor, we'll take that and we'll take that. Codex updated. The black vials. It's Alexa. Thank you. All right. Um, let me see. Where were we at with this one? Binding the fourth corpse walker. Yeah, I don't remember doing all this, so I won't try to read all that. We've done enough reading for today. Done enough educational stuff for today, boys and girls. All right, shambling. What is with the stairs in this temple? Look oh, there. look there. Yes, we know. Oh, Hicks. Adventurous journal. This book contains, uh, this book has a particular mustiness that derives not from old paper, but from a decomposing corpse. That is gross. New quest, unbound. Something is working behind the scenes in, the, in Ferelden. The notes you have acquired from dead or terrified adventures point to an ancient evil, or at least an ancient man telling stories of ancient evil. You have cause to speak with Vilm Madden, who lives somewhere in Denerim. Okay, so we have found a book that we must return. We've got a night corpse. What's it shall this? be done. We don't need that. 
So loot up. I don't need that either. Um, might as well get this XP. It is Oops. begun. Okay. Let us continue. Save. I shall do it. Right. Where are we at? Okay. Anything else? Looks good. Oh boy. Hello? Oh dear. Uh. Oh! Ouch. Ouch. Ow. Really? Why did I do that? Oh my gosh! That died. Uh, what am I supposed to? How am I supposed to kill this guy? All right. What am I supposed to do here? Okay. Okay. Can I go this way? No. 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 What about? What about here? No. Okay. How do you kill him? Uh, let's try this. Oops. Let's try this. Oh! I was getting ready to use one of my bombs. They killed him already. Well, good for you guys. Thanks for figuring it out without me. All right. I should have known that my headset was going to die. It is begun. Very well. Oh. Layer of the werewolves. Okay. What do we have here? We'll take all of that. Thank you. I'm gonna go across to here and loot. All right. What do we have? Did we did we loot him? I don't even remember. Oh, we did not. I'll take this. All these. We don't need the great sword. Yeah, that stuff we'll give to the dwarves, is it? Or I can't remember. Wait, what was that? It shall be done. Short bow. Yeah, we'll take that. 
What do we have here? Legacy White Shear. Peculiar and rare, a single rum run of the spirit took color in what has optimistically been called flavor from lyrium. So this is an alcoholic drink. We'll give that to either Wynn or Ogren. I'll take that. Probably don't need it. Don't know what's why the game's lagging. All right, on that note, we're going to go ahead and end it here. It has definitely been over an hour uh, with me recording. Um, so the next time I see you, we will be entering into the lair of the wolves. Werewolves, to be exact. And uh, see if we can um, put a kibosh on this here Cold War. Be well, it's not a Cold War. The kibosh between the werewolves and... Oh! Oh! Well, there we go. I did not mean to click on it, but we're in here. Anyways, like I said, we're going to go ahead and continue on next time. Hope you guys are enjoying the episodes. Let me know what you think about what's going on here with the werewolves and the elves. All right, guys, until next time. Ciao.